Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Essence of Shay. Happy Sunday. I woke up. I decided to try this apple cider clay mask. Don't mind the crust in my eyes. I am tired. Anyways, let's get right into this video. These are the products that I'll be using. Apple cider vinegar, tea tree oil, rose water, olive vera juice, grape seed, and Indian clay mask. I'm gonna use about a cup of the Indian clay mask. I'm just measuring that out. Um, I don't have that much in my container, so if it fills a cup, then it's a cup. Pour that in the bowl. Then I'm gonna add two heaping tablespoons of the grape seed oil. Next following is about 12 drops of the tea tree oil i will list all these ingredients in the description box below and the benefits of each i'm also adding about a cup of the apple cider vinegar to this mixture then i'm adding a cup of a mixture of the aloe vera juice and the rose water um to the bowl now i'm mixing it with a plastic spoon remember never use metal with the clay and then it comes out to this nice silky pudding-esque type situation. Now back to my beautiful face. <laughs> I'm gonna just take my little silk wrap off, undo my hair, wiggle it out a little bit, give you some facial features. <laughs> Anyways, this is how the clay looks after it's been mixed for a while and just been sitting. And it's like a nice, uh, silky consistency. I'm gonna be applying this with my hands, but you will see that I made a mistake. I was supposed to dampen my hair a little bit with this water and peppermint and just massage some of the dandruff and flakes off my scalp. Um, that's why you see the little patch of clay because I forgot to do that step. Hey, I'm always real with y'all, so it is what it is. So now I'm just massaging my scalp to just um, loosen up any dirt or whatnot and then I'm going to add the mask look I did not want to wash my hair before doing this because I didn't want to go in the shower and then come out the shower and then go back in the shower ain't nobody got water to waste okay <laughs> so I'm gonna just gonna apply this mask all over my hair and let me tell you guys something while doing this um, it felt weird, so the face is showing you the weirdness, but don't mind it. Um, but it was super easy to apply, not as hard that I as I thought it would be. I originally planned to just put this on my scalp, but I had a lot of mask left, so I'm gonna try to put it all over my locks. Let's see how that goes, because you guys know my locks are already thick and long so let's see how much it covers it did cover a decent amount so i'm happy with that this is how i will look when i'm older with my gray hair i think i look bomb yeah buddy so i'm gonna put my hair up in like a quick bun and fasten it with um a rubber band of some sorts and just chill out for like 45 minutes. I couldn't find a plastic bag or a shower cap. I don't know where everything disappeared to, so I'm just gonna jam to some music and just sit around and have this soak in my hair and do the do, get the magic happening. About 40 minutes to an hour later, I wash my hair. You guys know I use a t-shirt to dry it. I don't use towels because of the lint. And as with you, I'm just inspecting my hair because this is the first time I've ever done this, so I want to see what it does. And so far, I like the shine. I haven't put any products in my hair other than my shampoo. And I'm noticing the lint and stuff that are rising up to the surface. Um, so I noticed that part. It didn't freak me out because I heard that's what happens. So now I'm just gonna do the lock brushing method and just run the brush 
lightly over my hair. It looks like I'm brushing hard, but I'm actually not. I'm just gonna brush that over my hair and help with the removal of some of the lint, and then I'll go back and pluck out some the lint that I can get. Um, this is the back of my hair. You guys see my hair grows really quickly, so you can't really see the parts. Um, but yeah, I'm using my lavender hair spritz grow my lavender hair growth spritz to just bring the moisture back into my hair and just massage that in. This item will be back available soon. Then I'm gonna use my Covet hair oil. Uh, I can't wait for you guys to try this. It has all the good things that you need. Emu, carrot, uh, black seed oil, castor oil, just a lot of good stuff for your hair. Um, and I'm just gonna massage that in to seal in the moisture and give my hair more of a shine. Because who doesn't like shiny hair? <laughs> my hair looks healthy, man. Then I'm gonna use that Yes to Edges. You guys know about that. Is my third product. Yes to Edges, just all over my edges because you wanna keep your edges fleeky. And that's what I'm doing. Put it all around and then I'm gonna massage it in. And this is how my hair looks, folks. I'm actually pleasantly surprised. Overall, I would just say that uh, this is something good to try, but it's not a necessity. You can just do a simple apple cider rinse and get the same benefits. I didn't have a hard time taking out the mask, so that was an A plus for me. Anyways, guys, if I hope if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard.